right, day eight. Just a reminder, go check out Pauline's channel. She and I actually swapped um, Disney advent calendar pin things. So go check out what she got today. Oh, that's cool. Oh, wow. A moving pin. That is super cool. To go with my Animal Kingdom collection. That is super cute. With little Mickey and Donald on there. That is so cute. I love it. Thank you, Pauline. I love it so much. That is super cool. You know, I've never ridden that ride and I really want to. I never go in the summer though, so it's always kind of on the colder side. Thank you so much. I really love this pin. That is super cool. And I love the little moving element. That is really neat. Hi guys, welcome back to another day of Vlogmas. If you're new to my channel, I'm Mary, and for the month of December, my channel has transformed into a holly jolly holiday with Mary. Today, we are going to a vintage antique store, and we're gonna check out their Christmas stuff because today is like an open house. They're just setting out all of the Christmas goods stuff. So we're gonna go check them out and see what they have, because if you know me, you know that I love vintage everything, <laughs> but Christmas especially. So let's go check it out. We're here, we're here. There's kind of a lot of cars, but it's a big building, so I think we'll be okay. We got our masks, so we're good. <laughs>
that was super fun. <laughs> I got some stuff. Here's the shop information if you're interested. Not too busy, pretty good. I just picked up a couple things, so I'll show you those when I get back home. But also look how cute they gave us like a little sugar cookie. She said that they usually have like, so they're doing a raffle um, and they usually have like fresh cookies, like fresh homemade cookies or whatever. So she was like, these are bakery cookies, but we didn't think it was a good idea to bake cookies this year. So I hope these aren't frozen. These are like my favorite things ever. They're just like antibacterial wipes <laughs> that you can keep in your car. I should probably take them in though. Oh yeah, they're definitely a little frozen. <laughs> Does that make them less effective? Ooh, that's chilly. But I wanted to have a bite of cookie. Mmm, I love sugar cookies. Yum. Okay, we are back home. So I thought I would show you what I got. I'm so excited. First up, I got some really pretty ornaments. Three of them I don't think are vintage, but maybe they are? They're all glass anyway. <laughs> So I got three of these, so they all look the same, but I think they're just really pretty. I love that starburst design on there, and I love the shape of the ornament. So I got three of these. I had glitter all over my sweater after this. So I didn't have like a basket or anything, so I was just holding them like against my shirt. Made it very sparkly. <laughs> I think those are so pretty. I love them so much. And then I got this. I am such a sucker for the like, what are they called? Shiny bright, that's what they're called. Shiny bright ornaments. So let me put a hanger on this one so you can see it. They just had like a big cabinet basically of loose like ornaments, vintage ornaments. And I love these that have the like little hole like it goes inside there. It just looks so cool. And then it has the design on the outside. It has some gold details and a lot of silver. I prefer gold, but you guys know I prefer gold. <laughs> but uh, I thought this was really cool. So I did get this ornament. My first vintage shiny bright ornament that is like my very own. I'm pretty sure my mom has some at her house, but those are not mine, so. Just one random little ornament, so cute though. And then I got this like vintage looking Santa ornament that is like handcrafted with some crepe paper. I love these things. We used to uh, live in Greenfield, Indiana as little kids and we went to this church called St. Michael's. It's like a Catholic church and we went to the school there and stuff and it was super fun. Such good memories there, but every like Christmas time they would have a Christmas bazaar and everybody would like set up tables in the gymnasium and have like little crafts and things and there's so many things with like this crepe paper kind of stuff it's it's just really nostalgic for me <laughs> this like crepe papery stuff so anyway I got this super cute Santa ornament it's got some glitter detail look at the glitter <laughs> it's so pretty so, uh, yeah, I love this. I have a lot of like vintage looking Santa ornaments. I'm actually, if you come back on the 13th of December, I will be doing an entire uh, video about my collection of vintage looking Santa ornaments and Santa things in general. So <laughs> come back for that. If you're not subscribed, subscribe so you don't miss these things. I think it's so cute. I just love that like 50s style with the big rosy cheeks. It's so stinking cute. So I picked that up. It was only $3. All right, and then these two things, they're the same, but I got two of them. I randomly found in like a little basket. <laughs> it's like the tiniest wreath ever. They actually had one smaller than this, but it's made from like, I don't know if it's reclaimed like from old, old Christmas trees, but it kind of feels like that kind of like the 80s 70s and 80s style of Christmas tree. I don't really know what I'm gonna do with these yet, but I thought that they were way too cute not to buy them and they were only $3. So I low key wanna make like a little 
thing for Albert and Edie to wear, like... <laughs> I don't know. But I just thought these would be so cute. Anyway, that is my little haul. So that is everything that I got at the antique store during their Christmas open house. I also entered to win something in a raffle. I almost never win anything. I would say that I'd never win anything except I just won something recently. It's like every 10 years I win something from like a giveaway of some kind. So we'll see, maybe there'll be a Christmas miracle and I will win something from this raffle, but it was free. So I did that. And then we had our delicious sugar cookie. That was so nice. And we saw lots of really cute vintage stuff. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything. I feel like they had more stuff a few years back but I don't know, I might go back and check again another day just to see if they've put more stuff out. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you're having an awesome holiday season. If you enjoyed the video, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, I would love to have you as a Holly Jolly subscriber. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Thank you guys. Leave me a comment down below how your season is going. Do you like Christmas antiques? Do you like brand new stuff? I like both. I obviously like new stuff that looks like antiques as well. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next one. Remember, it is a good day to be holly and jolly. <laughs> and I hope you have a practically perfect day. <laughs>